Hi, I hope you're doing well and had a great summer. I've got an update for you on what's happening in real estate. I'm actually seeing the market cool off just a little bit. Um, that doesn't mean that we're going to start seeing prices go down though. Um, but it could affect you in lots of different ways. So um, I put together my thoughts on what this current market means, whether you're thinking of selling or buying or just staying where you're at. It never hurts to know the value of your home, even if you have no plans of moving anytime soon. Things do come up and it may be important for you to know how much equity you have in your home, whether that's paying for a college education or doing some updates or adding a pool, or maybe it's something even that isn't related to your home. So um, values have changed quite a bit since the beginning of the pandemic and your home may be worth more than you thought. When you purchased your home, if you used a down payment assistance program or you put down less than 20%, you're making a monthly mortgage insurance payment. And because of what's happened with the values of homes over uh, the past 18 months since the beginning of the pandemic, there's a good chance that you may have 20% of equity now. So um, you might be in a position where you can refinance and eliminate that mortgage insurance payment. Plus your interest rate is most likely lower uh, than it was then. So your payment might even go down along with eliminating that mortgage insurance. If you've had thoughts of selling your home or if you've got a rental property that you're just tired of dealing with tenants and broken toilets, you're still in the driver's seat as a seller. If your home's in a good location and has some upgrades, um, you should still expect a lot of activity and multiple offers on your property. However, I am beginning to see more and more properties spend a little bit longer time on the market before accepting an offer. If you're looking to purchase a home right now, you're still facing a competitive market. However, things are not as crazy as they were just even two months ago. Um, homes that were getting 20 to 30 showings and eight to 10 offers that first weekend, I'm starting to see some of those homes last more like a week or 10 days before accepting an offer. There is a bit of hope when it comes to making competitive offers. And some of my clients are not having to make or take as drastic of measures in order to get their offer accepted. Hey, thanks for watching. If you made it this far, um, I appreciate you. You're an absolute rock star. Uh, hopefully there was some info here that helped you understand your situation and this current real estate market a little bit better. Um, I'll talk to you soon. Thanks.